We're now just weeks away from the first day of school, but when you begin your back to school shopping, you may be in for some sticker shock. Oh, yeah. The National Retail Federation says inflation is also impacting backpacks, pencils, and paper, and that could bring concern for shoppers when trying to get supplies. Joining us now live from Meyer is Six News reporter Autumn Pitcher. That's right. She's got the breakdown on this year's spinning and price comparisons. Good morning, Autumn. Good morning, everyone. Officials say families on average will spend $15 more on school supplies this year. Now, if you look over here, you can see planners are $11.99 up to $15.99. And over here, I'm going to show you some more products. We have these highlighters right now for $8.99. They are buy one, get one 40% off. Same deal with these pens right here, but they are $11.99 for this full pack. And then we also have whiteout, but this is on sale for $2.79 right now. We also have this full pack of pencils. This is mechanical pencils on sale for $6.99 right now. So these are some of those prices you can expect right now. But according to the National Retail Federation, spending on school clothes and supplies this year is on track to match last year's record high of $37 billion. Officials say that families with kids in school will spend an average of $864. And officials say prices are up by nearly 15% this back to school season. For example, backpacks are up by nearly 12% bringing the average to $70. And with these skyrocketing prices, NRF says more families are planning on skipping travel or using their savings to be able to buy necessities like backpacks, markers, and notebooks. Some parents in the community tell me they've had to shift their approach with shopping, being more selective, including Katie Curran, who lives in Lansing and is a mom of an 11-year-old girl. We're hopefully using the same backpack. I'm trying to convince her to use the same backpack from last year. Um, because if we, the thing is we have a budget and so it's like the more things we don't have to buy, then it's like, those are things we don't have to squeeze into that budget. So if we don't have to get a backpack, then that frees up more money to get shoes. You know, it's kind of, I hate to say it, but it's kind of like we have to choose. Now, even though it's not a lot, some stores are offering coupons. You can see right now that Meyer has some things that are on sale. But to find all those coupons and more details, you can head on over to our website at WLNS.com. Here for you live in Okemos, Autumn Pitcher, 6 News.